All right, guys. So here's what I have, how I kind of clamped everything up. If you need something similar or if you want to pick up the same exact kit from your local hardware store, in this case, it was from Home Depot, you can buy the same exact thing. It's a galvanized coated cable and it comes with the kit. So all of the parts that you need to accomplish the same setup. Now, the actual pulley, I grabbed this one from Amazon. This is obviously a lot better quality than what you would get at Home Depot. But if you want to save yourself a few bucks, you can pick any pulley really from, uh, from your local hardware store for a lot cheaper than this one. I believe this was 30 bucks. I'll leave a link in the description. Super easy to accomplish. It's just basically a board reinforced with uh, two other pieces underneath just for reinforcement, not only reinforcement, but you need to leave a little space for the nut and bolt in the bottom, plus the washer, so that it's not obviously sitting on the ground, otherwise it's gonna be unbalanced. So this way it leaves a little bit of a space for that, so it serves two purposes. All right, so let me demonstrate it real quick so you can see how everything works. All right, so I'm just gonna get up on the platform now, I don't have an actual belt, specific belt for this. I don't know if you can even see me in the video, but I'm just using anything right now with basically an S-clamp or S-hook. And I'm just hooking it into uh, basically a, a belt, any power lifting belt that I have laying around. It's going to do the same thing. Obviously, you can't go too heavy with this, otherwise it's going to break the buckle. But nonetheless, I'm going to squat down over here and I'm just going to kind of set this up so that I can go all the way down to the bottom, hook it into the, uh, to the cable, set my feet and now just you can perform your, your belt squats. So when you're done with this, all you have to do is basically take it off the carabiner from the cable station and store it away. So the cool thing about the setup, right, is let's say that you don't necessarily have a cable station to set this up. Well, let's say that you all you have is a pull up bar or even a squat rack. All you need to do really is basically buy another pulley that you can attach either to the barbell that's kind of sitting on the J hooks of the squat rack, or if you have a pull-up bar, obviously you need another pulley and a longer cable, which if you buy the kit, it's a 30 foot cable. You can actually go around another pulley down to a loading pin where you put all the weights and it accomplishes the same exact things. Hopefully this was informative and helped you out trying to figure out how to perform uh, belt squats at home. So, so let me know down in the comments below if uh, you've actually built one of these to set it up either to this or anything. Until next time, see you guys.